Fort Lauderdale, Florida. This is NAB Show Live. Ryan Saddles are here with another edition of NAB Show Live and Broadcast Beats pre-NAB Show coverage. Today we have a very special guest, Doug Wynn, VP of Sales for the Americas at SGL. How you doing, sir? Very well. Thank you so much. Thanks for being with us. So talk about SGL and what you guys, what you guys do and how you guys got started. Well, SGL is a privately held company that's been in business for over 25 years now. The original owners are still very much a part of the day-to-day -day business. Uh, we're headquartered in the UK, in the southern part. All our development's under one roof there, and our support is out of, global support is out of Cincinnati, Ohio. Uh, we started off in the IT space and then slowly moved into pre-press, and then since uh, early 2000, we've been in the M&E space with moving pictures and much bigger files. Uh, we are a archive middleware, HSM if you will, that moves material from online to nearline, be that spinning disk, or to LTO Robotic, or to Sony ODA, or to the cloud, uh, or all of the above, depending on what your needs are. Great, and I, I see that you guys have a migration service. Uh, you even deal with a lot of different aspects of workflow. Uh, looking at your site right now, FlashNet, Flash Web, Flash Box, uh, and Storage Manager along with FlashPack. Could you talk about those a little bit? Sure. Uh, FlashNet is the main product that we have, and it uh, connects to various different MAM partners. We have over 65 different MAM companies that we work with. And then from there, there's a sub-manager called Storage Manager, and that allows for rules-based movement and life cycle and that type of thing of the material. FlashPack is a little integrated system that we put together uh, that it has a either a 1 by 20 or a 2 by 20. It includes all the hardware and software, basically an archive in a box, if you will. And now with the advent of LTO 7, that's very powerful because it allows for over 120 terabytes of storage online in one, one library. Flashbox is slightly larger. It's a bigger pack, uh, tape library with more slots. But the main core system itself is FlashNet. Excellent. So uh, obviously you guys are going to be focusing on some announcements at NAB. If you could talk about that, that would be awesome. Absolutely. Uh, I think the thing we're most excited about is uh, FlashNet Infinity, which is a new user interface, web-based, and it's custom configurable, customer configurable. And we've taken a dashboard type approach to it, which allows you to have different widgets within it. So that would be archive, restore, analytics, system health, that type of thing. And that's going to be rolled out over the next 12 months. And for us, it's a really exciting thing because we haven't done a new user interface since the company's been around. So it's a big, big difference. We'll also be announcing support of reading and restoring uh, AXF files, the exchange format that was recently uh, signed off on by Simpty. So that's a good deal and gives some more options for the end users. We will also be announcing our AVID certification. We've gone through the certification process, so we're now certified with AVID Production Asset Management, and AVID MAM. Further to that, we'll be announcing support of Sony C, which is their cloud-based system. In addition, we'll have a couple, uh, ODA library on our booth, and we're also going to be in the Sony booth on their media backbone. They're going to be using us to be doing migrations over there. Other highlights, I guess, would be um, we're announcing uh, partial file restore powered by Gluecast using AVID Interplay web services. Uh, that's exciting because in the past you haven't been able to re do a uh, partial restore. You've had to do the whole event. So particularly for sporting and that type of thing where you've got three hours of a camera feed on second base or something, and all you want to do is bring back the two hits or the two times people went by there, it makes it really easy to do that. Additionally, we'll be highlighting uh, the REST API. Uh, so that makes it much easier for our partners to write to us. And as previously mentioned, support of LTO7. Uh, with the six terabytes of storage and 300 megabytes of throughput. Again, Doug Wynn, VP of Sales for the Americas at SGL. Thanks so much for spending some time with us, sir. Go ahead and share your booth number. Thank you very much. Our booth is the South Lower Hall, booth number 5306, and it's a brand new booth this year, so please come by.